Good morning, and thank you all for being here today. I'm Bill Powers. I'm the president of the University of Texas at Austin. With me here today are two people that you know very well, our men's athletic director, Dolores Dodds, and our women's athletic director, Chris Polonsky. I have a short statement, and then we'll be open for questions. I'm pleased to announce today that the University of Texas at Austin is reaffirming its commitment to the Big 12 Conference. This is a long-term and unequivocal commitment. After spending several months examining and evaluating our options uh, in the changing world of, of Division I athletics, we've decided the Big 12 provides the best long-term opportunity for our university. In reaching this decision, we've taken into account the impact on our student athletes, financial ramifications of the various options, and the interests of our Big 12 partners. We've been served well by the, by the Big 12 since its, since its, its uh, inception, and it's always been our top priority to keep the Big 12 together. We believe a newly constituted 10-member conference will continue to benefit all of the members of our, all of our member institutions and the University of Texas at Austin. We are committed to a new, long-term, 10-team structure. Thank you. And now we'll take questions. Yes, ma'am. We've evaluated the value long-term of a 10-team conference, and we feel that it is very positive. Exactly what numbers will be reached will depend on uh, market negotiations, but we feel very confident that this is a very viable and strong uh, economic conference. What are the factors that make you feel confident? We have a great tradition in this league. We've had national champions in many sports in this league. Uh, certainly in football and basketball, Olympic sports. We have had very good television ratings. These are all factors that uh, lead us to believe we have a very strong future in the, big, in the, in the new 10-team Big 12. We're not guaranteed. Uh, these, are, these will be part of negotiations. We've had indications that uh, we will go forward with uh, very strong economics. We do not have any guarantees from the league or our northern partners. There have been reports that uh, there's going to be a special deal for some of us uh, using penalty money or other money to uh, guarantee Texas and possibly other schools of uh, particular value. Uh, we were not part of that. We had heard about that. Uh, we're not part of it. That was not part of our consideration, and we oppose uh, that kind of deal. We will be distributing money in the Big 12 according to the normal Big 12 distribution. Well, we spent a great deal of time with the Pac-10. Anytime there's a, uh, in any business or enterprise relationship, you compare uh, the terms and value in each of the options and possibilities. I am not in a position to comment on the Pac-10's uh, offer or discussions. There's a lot of proprietary information in those, and we're going to honor the confidentiality of the PAC-10. Let me say the PAC-10 representatives and their institutions, it is a great league. They uh, were extremely professional in all of our discussions. Uh, 
but it is a comparison of uh, our options under our arrangement with the Big 12 and what might have happened with the Pac-10. And it is our view that it is an our uh, strong, uh, both economic and traditional and uh, looking out for our student athletes in our strong interest to remain uh, in a 10-team Pac-12.